Looking to learn about the latest technology? How does that gizmo you bought work? What are the innovations of the future? Our Gadget Girls can help. Our four Gadget Girl hosts were selected for their engineering and technology backgrounds. We took them out of their tech environment and put them in front of a television camera to guide you as we look for the newest innovations and coolest high-tech discoveries. Carolyn is a process designer in the energy industry. Sasha is a senior business analyst. Janelle is studying mechanical engineering, energy and management. And Ethel is an assistant technical engineering officer. These are the Gadget Girls. We are breaking new ground, gentlemen, letting you know that the ladies are making headway in the tech field. Join them as they decipher the latest and greatest gadgets, inventions, consumer products, and high-tech innovations, right here on Gadget Girls. Thanks for joining us today on Gadget Girls, the must-see show for technology updates and news on electronics and innovation. Here's what we've got lined up for you today. We're taking a look back in time and tracing the evolution of robotic toys. From wind-up models to battery-operated robots, this technology continues to wow us as it develops and evolves into smarter versions. And speaking of smart, imagine a computer that can read your thoughts. Sounds like sci-fi and it is possible. Thought-controlled computing, and we've got it here for you today on Gadget Girls. It was very exciting as I had the chance to meet up with Ariel Garten from Interaxon, where she opened the door to this new thought-based technology of the future. And also on the show today, we're going to show you how to green it up in style with a cool solar charger. This Solio charger started a movement. Stay tuned to see how. And today in Curious Gadgets, we introduce you to a cool new music player that blocks at the competition. Think Rubik's Cube meets Stereo System, and you have Music Blocks. And for all you BlackBerry fanatics, our next gadget might just make you even more addicted. Designed as a companion accessory, this device makes going hands-free and being on the road a breeze. Carolyn was in the studio to tell us more about the Pulse from Alerta. Finally, Ethel's on location demonstrating a complete workstation chair unlike any you've ever seen before. The Novel Quest workstation chair makes multi-monitor tasks a total comfort. Keep it locked to see why this chair is creating a global buzz. But before we get to it all, take a look at this week's Green Gadget. Most of today's gadgets are electronic, which means they require battery charges and in return can consume a lot of energy. That's why solar charges are popping up in the market everywhere. The Solio is one of the newest charges that can power and adapt to over 3,000 devices. The three blades fan out to give the charger more range to soak up the sun with its hybrid solar panels. Once the Solio is fully powered, it can hold the charge for up to a year. This means if you don't need your charger right away, it will store the sun's energy up to a year for when you're ready to use it. So the next time you need to power up your favorite gadgets, think of the sun's benefits and utilizing your natural resources. Today on Gadget Girls, we're focusing on a new environmentally friendly movement that is quickly gaining popularity around the world. With the increase of large city buildings, high-rise condos and offices, the need for farming and green space is growing faster than we think. Sky, wall and urban farming are becoming more popular in North America with plans to expand globally. The active living wall by Needla looks aesthetically pleasing and serves as an indoor air biofilter. This vertical hydroponic green wall could effectively remove common indoor contaminants and improve the conditions of the living environment. The plants include a range of flowers and foliage such as ferns and orchids. Air is actively forced through the green wall of plants and highly specialized biological components actively degrade pollutants in the air. The clean, cool air is then distributed throughout the space by a mechanical ventilation system. The system uses plants which have no soil. There is constant water flowing which is cycled through the system with two pumps that are installed. The active living wall can be placed in offices and high-rise buildings across the world. Not only does the living wall have the potential to create a better breathing environment, it will also cut down on the cost of electrical air filters. And from living walls to an entire center, this next urban farming system comes from designer Blake Kurasek of Chicago, Illinois. The new skyscraper hopes to produce commodities to support its residents and the surrounding urban population. Most of the tower plans to have farmers markets that will sell fruits and vegetables grown right from the building. This has the potential to reduce the cost on food shipping as well as fuel consumption. There are plans to implement a water purification system built right into the tower that will source water from Lake Michigan. And once the water is used for plant and vegetation growth, the clean, filtered water will be pumped back into the lake. 
These are just two of the initiatives that environmentalists and designers are creating so that our busy built-up cities will also provide a healthier place for generations to come. And that's news from around the world.